Hi, here we have our algebraic expression x cubed plus x squared is equal to 1 over 8. So let's start our solution. And the first time I will going to multiply both the side with 8. So the next equation we get here this 8 and it get cancels. 8x cubed plus 8x x squared is equal to 1. Now we're going to take this one to the left hand side. So it will turn to negative sign. Now here I will going to change this 8 in the form of power. So 2, 3 times give you 8 and then x cubed. 2, 3 times give you 8 x squared minus 1 is equal to 0. Now on the next step, 2 raised to the power 3, x raised to the power 3, plus here this 2 raised to the power 3, I will going to write in this form, 2, 2 times raised to the power 2, x squared minus 1 is equal to 0. Here we have the same power, so I will going to write this 2x raised to the power 3, here 2 bracket 2x raised to the power 2 minus 1 is equal to 0. Now now I am going to work Px is equal to t. So the next expression we get t cube plus 2t square minus 1 is equal to 0. Now I will going to split this middle term. So I am going to write in this form t cube plus t square plus t square minus 1 is equal to 0. In the next step, I am going to take common from this t square t plus 1 plus here I am going to apply the algebra identity that is a square minus b square is equal to a minus b a plus b. So by using this, I am going to write this expression t plus 1 t minus 1 is equal to 0. I am going to take out the latest common factor here t plus 1 t square is remaining and here this we already took the common here t minus 1 is remaining. Now we have two cases t plus 1 is equal to 0 t square plus t minus 1 is equal to 0. So here t is equal to minus 1 I am going to recall t is equal to 2x. Now I am going to plug in the value of t. So tx is equal to negative 1. x is equal to negative 1 over t. So this is the answer for case 1. Now I am going to solve the case 2. Here we have the quadratic expression. So I will going to find out the discriminant first how many roots uh, we find out from this other equation. So the discriminant formula we have is equal to 1 square minus 4 1 plus 1 here 1 plus here 1 plus 4 is equal to 5 so here the discriminant we find out that is greater than 0 so here we get Two roots for this second case. Now I'm going to plug in the value in the quadratic formula. So here we have the quadratic formula. Our b is one plus minus a one whole square minus four one negative one over two one. T1 is equal to negative 1 plus minus here 1 plus 4 over 2 T1 comma 2 T1 comma 2 is equal to minus 1 plus minus root 5 over 2. Now here I will going to record T is equal to 2x, so I'm going to plug in the value of t here, 
So here I have two x is equals to minus one plus minus root five by root two. Now here I will be able to multiply both the sides with one over two. So here this and will get cancelled. So the remaining expression we have minus one plus minus root five, and this I will be able to multiply so over here. So here we got x1 value that is minus 1 plus root 5 over 4 and x2 minus 1 minus root 5 over 4. So this is our final answer. Now I am going to verify my answer by plugging the value of x. x2 plus x square is equal to 1 over 8. So our x2 value we find out for placement that is 1 to 1 over 2, 8 plus negative 1 over 2, so the star is equal to 1 over 2. Here we have the cube, so the answer we get is negative. So here, 1 over 8 plus 1 over 4 is equal to 1 over 8. Here we will find out the LC, negative 1 plus 2 is equal to 1 over 8. So 1 over 8 is equal to 1 over 8. So here we, the left hand side equal to the right hand side. So the value of x we find out that is absolutely correct. Thank you for watching our video. If you do not subscribe to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel.